It's Thursday. Let's get geeky on global warming. We all know that climate change is the greatest threat our species has ever faced, but it could be worse than even predicted, according to a new study published in the journal Nature. That study found that climate change may cause global temperatures to rise by at least 4 degrees Celsius, 7.2 degrees Fahrenheit, by the year 2100. The scientists behind the study came to this conclusion by looking at the role that clouds play in moderating temperatures on the planet. They found that as the planet continues to warm, there will be fewer clouds that are able to reflect the sun's rays, meaning temperatures will rise even faster. Stephen Sherwood, lead researcher on the study, told The Guardian that 4C would likely be catastrophic rather than simply dangerous. For example, it would make life difficult, if not, not impossible, in much of the tropics and would guarantee the eventual melting of the Greenland ice sheet and some of the Antarctic ice sheet. Unless we act now, these newly predicted temperatures are going to make it hard for mankind and the rest of the animal kingdom to survive, and the plant kingdom for that matter. That includes organisms that are living in some of the darkest, coldest, and deepest environments on Earth that we once thought were untouchable. A study published in the journal climate, uh, Global, climate, or, excuse me, Global Change Biology reveals that thanks to climate change and global warming, seafloor marine life will decrease by as much as 38% in the North Atlantic Ocean and up to 5% globally over the next 100 years. Organisms that live in the deepest depths of the ocean rely heavily on the remains of the marine life that lives on or near the ocean surface. That stuff dies and settles and the stuff on the bottom eats it. As a result, the, head of the health of the surface ocean waters has a huge impact on the health of deep ocean waters and the microorganisms that call them home. So as nutrients are being depleted on the surface of the ocean, thanks to climate change, organisms living in deep ocean waters can't get the nutrients and the food they need for survival. These findings on deep sea marine life prove that when it comes to climate change and its effect, nothing is out of reach. To learn more about the greatest threat our species has ever faced and what's driving it, check out lasthours.org and the documentary Last Hours which the organization EcoWatch just named as one of the 10 best documentaries of 2010. Here's a short clip from last hours. Earth without life. We take life for granted, but life has not always flourished here. The Earth has experienced dramatic loss of life, or what we call mass extinctions, five times over the course of geologic history. Each one of these events has resulted in the loss of more than half of all life on Earth. Today, a sixth extinction is underway, one that will test the survival of not just human civilization, but possibly of the human species itself.